Yo, what the fuck is up guys? It's Mr. Professor Snowman back here with yet another Tro video today on the Xbox and right off the bat I'm gonna start by saying sorry if you guys can hear cars and stuff outside I live on a busy ass road and it's very hot outside today and I need my window open because I'm literally gonna die of heat exhaustion So right off the bat today, we are gonna go right into my claims We got 15 box salvage because I did my tomes because I was doing hard carries earlier 5 chaos chests, 1500 cubits, empowered gem box from the neon ninja, 9th life from boomeranger uh, the fucking Empowered Gem Box from that, Blocks Destroyed Empowered Gem Box, oh my god, all this good stuff, who even cares? Uh, I'm gonna be saving these Empowered Gem Boxes for tomorrow. Um, guys, please don't spam carries in the chat, I will be doing carries all day today after I record this video, up until I go and record Mass Effect, and then probably some more later tonight. I'm gonna try getting everyone in and getting you guys all done. Uh, I will probably be doing Alt 1 and 2, maybe I might try getting a few Alt 1 and 2 carries in, and then, uh, I don't know about 3 and 4 yet. Hopefully I can get those done before tomorrow so I can get even more Empowered Gem Boxes, but I'm gonna be doing, getting my Empowered Gem Box Tome. And then I'm gonna get one from that, and then probably three more from Daughter, and then I think another three from uh, Ultra Daughter if I do Ultra Daughter. So that'd be really lit. Hopefully, I can get double digit empowered gem boxes, get a diamond dragon egg, but right off the bat, open these up. Oh my god, we got a fucking, I don't know what the hell I just said, but we got a, uh, we got a pearl. So that's actually good shit. I actually need a pearl because I'm my pirate captain right now. I bought a stellar, not a stellar, whoops, I bought, oh my god, Jesus Christ, I bought a stellar weapon from Napalm and a stellar, er, oh my god, the Radiance, you fucking idiot, I bought a Radiant gun from Napalm, and I bought a Radiant face from Hard Rock, so now I have pretty good stats on my uh, Pirate Captain, I'm actually loving this character a lot, but definitely expect more content on the channel of the Pirate Captain. Alright, so a lot of you guys yesterday told me that I missed this costume from the Double Dragon pack I bought, and it actually looks pretty sick. I'm actually kind of sad I forgot it. I wasn't going to implement it into the video. As you guys saw from yesterday's video, it did pretty good, but it got disliked by it sadly because someone has a very small penis or gets beat by their family. Snowman Savage just beat them out with the likes. So if you guys see anyone on the game, my gamer tag on the game is Mr. Space Snowman with three W's. Do not trade anyone else anything or don't even trade me anything. Just don't get scammed. People are going around with my gamer tag. I saw the same thing happen to Vox. So everyone's just going around with our gamer tags. Um, if it's like a different version of it or whatever and they're scammy people for items. So only trust Mr. Space Snowman with three W's guys. It's very important that you do that. But as of right now, we're going to get the Lunar Lancer up to level 10. I just want to get all these out of the way real quick just because I really want to... Uh, get this show on the road i don't really know what costume i'm gonna get out of this but fuck it right i know this commentary and this gameplay is all over the place but real quick real quick i'm gonna hit 15k on my shadow hunter i don't know if i have enough dust to do it but i definitely have enough luck bugs and shit to get up there oh oh right here oh look at that fire gem dust uh we should probably level up this one hopefully i get lucky with the luck bugs level up please oh you fucker jesus christ all right which is close to 25 i should be able to get at least 15k just off one of these gems i do need a few air gem dust for that uh water gem dust i'm not really close to any of these i could get a bunch of water gem dust real quick it's not really a big deal so we're probably gonna hop into a u8 water world and get a bunch of water gem dust and level up that gem because i really want to hit 15k today on my shadow hunter and uh plus it looks 15k just looks better than 14,000. i'm i'm over 14k I'm just, I'm sick of it, but hopefully this week I get a Diamond Dragon Egg. I'm going to probably be getting the Water Dragon, or the Water Primordial Dragon, if I do end up getting it. I'm probably not going to, though, so I don't know why I'm hyping myself up about it. Uh, last night, I bought 10 Heart of Darknesses for like 100k Flux, so I'm kind of broke right now. Uh, I'm going to see if I can buy 10 more today, and that's going to be my next dragon, probably, is the uh, Dormant Dust Dragon Egg. I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. I really hope I'm not butchering that, but that's definitely going to be my next dragon. Uh, you guys are probably gonna be like, why aren't you a new 9 snowman? UA just goes so much faster, so I'm just gonna do that. It's I just need um, water gems anyway, just so I can level up this gem. And hit, hit 15k. I was gonna play the Chloromancer today, because you guys have been suggesting it by popular demand. A lot of you guys want to see a Chloromancer. I will be getting to the Chloromancer, do not worry. Uh, whether it's in this video or the next video, I will be playing the Chloromancer. Tomorrow's video, I'm gonna be doing Daughter of the Moon, like always, because that's just a Tuesday ritual. That's when I do all my Empowered Gem Box openings and uh, carry through Daughter of the Moon. If you guys do any carries today, I will be doing one through three. Just please do not spam in the chat. Uh, I don't carry Daughter of the Moon on Mondays because uh, basically I, I just save it for Tuesdays because that's what I like to do on my videos. But yeah, so uh, we're, we're kind of close. We only need like less than a thousand uh, dust, which is probably about 10 or 15 dungeons. And I do them pretty quickly, so it's not going to be too bad. It won't be too cancer, but I just want 15k, honestly. But um, yeah, so next video or the video after that, I probably will be playing my Chloromancer. Like I said earlier, uh, my Boomeranger is getting his class gem first. 
and then after that I will begin my Chlor Matches class gem because like I said a lot of you guys actually have been telling me the Chlor Matches class gem is pretty overpowered and pretty lit. I know it's based off RNG like whether it spawns or not I'm pretty sure I hope I'm not butchering that because I don't want to get roasted. But um, I think it spawns off RNG. We'll go to this big ass dungeon. Jesus Christ, let's go. Um, right now, we did do alt, or not alt 1 and 2. We did uh, hard 1 and 2 earlier today for a carry, and I didn't have time to do 3 because I really want to get this video out. Didn't want it to be too late, so I did get one shaper Starkey. I can level up my Stellars a little bit. I'm going to be spending all of my Titan Souls this week just on Shaper Starkeys because I want to level up level up all of my Stellars. I could actually level up one of my Stellars right now and get 15k, but I don't know why I'm going for the Dust first. But we'll probably get the Dust, and if that doesn't get it, then we will be going into the Everdark and definitely be getting 15k today. It's definitely happening. That's all I want to do. I might even be able to hit 15,100 15, Power Rank. Who even knows? But um, I was going to get the 200, top 250 Boom Ranger for uh, this week or last week's challenge. But I didn't want to spend 2500 flux to move all of my goddamn gems over. So that's one of the reasons I didn't get top 250. I'm pretty sure you just got to be uh, 13,000 and up. Or uh, I think it was actually 11,000 up to be top 250. Which I was going to do. But it would have cost me like 30k flux. And all I would have gotten was a key. Like I, I mean I guess it kind of could have been worth it. But I just wasn't really feeling it. So last night before I went to bed. Oh my god what the fuck. How do you even do this dungeon? Jesus Christ find the pirate lord last night before i went to bed i took all my gear off my shadow hunter like the bow face and hat and put them on my boom ranger and i ended up becoming i don't know what rank i think i was like top 700 just from doing that oh my god what the fuck is this lag i'm gonna throw my internet fucking provider out the window that makes no sense throw my fucking router out the window jesus christ fucking ass jesus christ Yeah, but I want to thank you guys all so much for watching my video yesterday and commenting and liking it. It means a lot to me. I love seeing all the comments you guys left. A lot of you guys actually mentioned that I missed a few things from the pack. I try my best not to miss anything from the packs I buy, but I'm honestly a goddamn retard. And I cannot remember to actually look at what the description says and actually follow along with it. I'm sorry this video is going up so late today, guys. It's going to take a lot of editing because I keep fucking up. But I'm, I'm, I worked all day today. And uh, I worked from like, uh, I want to say like 8 to 5.30. And I have to do wake up at 7 o'clock tomorrow. So I won't be on too late tonight. But like I said, I will be doing carries all day today. Just like I said, do not spam them. We got to almost have enough boxes. I think today mo today is Monday. So all the stats are still active. So I might even grind you 7 tonight a little bit. I don't really know what I'm to do yet. Just because I want to just get a bunch of hard keys. And then get that over for the week. Or maybe actually I might even farm ultra keys. Just so I get a bunch of shadow chests. I don't know if I want to open them up. I'm probably going to open up a bunch of just Shadow Caches and just get a fuck ton of uh, Heart of Darknesses. I'm pretty sure I only have 10 right now. So uh, once I get... Uh, or 10 or 5. I can't remember which one I bought. I think I bought the 10 one because I spent a fuck ton of Flux. But let me see real quick how many uh, Gem Dust we get from these. Oh, we're going to hit the Karma Bar. Got a Radiant. Pretty shitty. No Star Radiant. But we do have like 15 boxes. We should be able to dismantle all of these and then level up my gems. So let's go find a house now. I'm going to pray here because I'm tired of doing dungeons already. I just want to get this goddamn video out. But uh, we're going to... Oh, little little golden soul. Hello. All right. So, fuck the form of sight. Here's a house. Let's see. Moment of truth here. Everything's going to come in here. I got to slaughter real quick. But, ooh, winter chest. Uh, we're, I think we're almost actually at the karma bar for this. Uh, not really. Kind of. Not kind of, kind of. We're at like fucking 40. That was a pew pew. Pew pewer style? What the fuck? I think I just got real party style. What the hell is exploding in my house? What the actual fuck? There we go. Alright, so now we're going to dismantle all of these gems we have. I think I just got rid of something I didn't want to get rid of, but fuck it. I hope I really didn't. But now we should have enough water gem dust to level this up. Oh my god, we don't. I'm going to kill myself. Alright, so plan B. We're going to take this level 17 gem, use a luck bug on it, level it up. 15,000 power rank. We cut the corners. We hit 15k power rank, guys. Let's fucking go. Uh, tomorrow, I'm probably going to be hitting... 15,500 or 15,600. I'm going to be grinding a bunch of dust tonight because it is the last. I don't know what the hell I want to do. I want to have so many things I want to do tonight. But tonight, I probably will be grinding a bunch of dungeons and shit like that because I need dust. So I'm probably going to put all the flux I want to earn and shit like that on the back burner just so I can do that one simple thing. Um, we're going to be switching to the Lunar Lancer real quick and actually go level him up because I want to get him to up to level 10 so I can start leveling him up off camera. Because um, if you guys don't know, if you guys are new to the channel, welcome first of all. And second of all, I get my characters up to level 10 on video, level 20 on video, and level 30. So, we're going to be going into probably, what the hell can I even do? Probably just like a Master World, right? Uh, 8 through 9. Alright, so we're going to go into here. 
it's gonna be entertaining, I promise. But the Lunar Lancer, I heard that the Lunar Lancer is kind of shit inside of Shadow Tower, but it's very quick with dungeon clears like the Neon Ninja is. So if you guys are wondering for a pretty quick DPS and how to do dungeons pretty quick, I suggest the Lunar Lancer. Shadow Hunter is obviously good, but I heard that this can get a big debuff and get nerfed a lot. Um, I heard I think Pirate Captain actually gets a buff. I'm not too sure on that. So you PC players out there can let me know. Let me know if the uh, PC. Uh, if, if you guys got a debuff for the Shadow Hunter and then a buff for the Pirate Captain, I'm not sure. Pirate Captain's pretty overpowered right now. I'm definitely going to be maining him eventually because he is one of my favorite characters in the game at the moment because his ultimate literally is so goddamn overpowered. Also, the Boom Ranger is overpowered. Every, I just want to play every goddamn character. Like Everything is just so much fun to me. The Shadow Hunter is obviously still Babe, and I'm going to be getting her, or her, Jesus Christ, rest in peace. I'm going to be getting it up to probably 18k. I think 18k is the max I can go without Primordial Dragons. I'm pretty sure Hard Rock told me that. But uh, anyways, tomorrow, guys, tomorrow is Tuesday. So in the morning, I'm going to be doing Daughter and then recording that, put that up, and open up all my boxes. So stay tuned for that. And also, me and a few of the officers and Leo got together and recorded a video together. And that will be out Tuesday night, which is tomorrow. So if you guys are interested in that, a lot of you guys are probably either going to very, very much like the game and think it's the funniest thing in the world, or you guys are going to fucking hate it and never want me to play it again. Uh, either or is fine, honestly. I didn't really mind the game. The game was kind of fun. Some of you already joined on us and you already know what's going on, but just don't spoil it for people that are actually waiting to see what it is. We're going to go into here. I never know how to do this dungeon, but we're going to figure it out anyways, because fuck it, right? Oh, wait. I still don't even know how to get into it. What the hell is this? But, oh, the portal was hidden. What the fuck? Oh, there we go. Oh, what? what's happening? Why am I... I'm fishing. Why am I fishing? I don't want to fish. There we go. This thing is pretty quick. Uh, wave clear? I want to say that's what the hell it's called. We're just going to bomb straight down. Because, honestly, that's, that's probably how you do it. Every dungeon's like that. So, we'll pop the ultimate. I think that gives you, like, attack speed and stuff like that. And maybe a damage buff when you're staying inside of it. And they might take... No, I don't think that they take damage when they're inside of it. But, well, basically... All of the gems that I get on my Shadow Hunter that I don't think are good enough for him, I'm either going to put on my Neon Ninja or on my Lunar Lancer. So, um, I'm going to be putting a bunch of stellar gems on it. So, if you guys see my PR skyrocket, that's why. I actually get a lot of questions saying, Snow, how are you such a low level with such a high PR? And, um, basically, I just get gems on my Shadow Hunter that I grind. Like, I grind U9 non-stop, and then these two-star stellars I get from that I keep if they're good. Like, as of right now, I have three perfect gems on my Pirate Captain. And he's ready to get leveled up. I just currently have him at like level 17. And I have all the gems at level 1. So that's why he's not really up there that much. But once I level up his gems to like 5 or 10 each. He should be 5k and I will get his class gem eventually. Honestly this week I'm just hoping for a bunch of fragments. Like I don't even care if I get any stellar gems. Don't care if I get a diamond dragon egg. I really just want to get a bunch of uh, fragments. Because I want class gems for all my characters so I can start playing them more. Uh, don't worry guys, when I get the class gem for my Chloromancer, I'm going to be playing her a lot more. Like I said, a lot of you guys actually want to see the Chloromancer. I don't really know why. Let me know down below why, but um, I'll definitely be playing him or her. I, I made my character a girl. Completely forgot about that, but I don't really enjoy the Revenant that much or the Candy Barb. But this week, the Candy Barb is actually one of the top, like it to be top powering to actually get rewards. So I will definitely be sure to be putting my gear on him before I go to bed on um, fucking Sunday. So, oh, I don't know why the hell I waste all my bombs, but I'll definitely be putting all my uh, gear on him before I leave, uh, or before I go to bed, actually, on Sunday. So, I'll wake up and have empowered gem boxes and shit like that for the character, but I think they just auto-equipped the new, I think it just auto-equipped the new uh, costume we got. But this is the new costume for the Lunar Lance. It doesn't look that bad. We'll do a dance real quick so it shows better, because this guy's fucking hunchback. Alright, yeah, that's a little bit better. But yeah, this is the new costume for him. I think it looks kind of cool. Obviously, it's not as cool as the costume I have on currently. Which I'm going to have to switch back to. The Dusk Rider Dragon. This one looks pretty cool. Once I get the Dust Dormant Dragon Egg. Or once I get the dragon that uh, you make with it. It's going to look pretty sick on this character. Because right now I just had the Block Dragon. And it doesn't really fit in that well. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm sorry if it was kind of a short one today. I will be having a longer one out tomorrow. Today I'm just very tired. And I just wanted to put out a video for you guys. Plus I kind of want to rush around. And I also want to do hard carries for all of you guys today. So you don't have to keep stressing about it all week long. Um, also Mass new Mass Effect video will be out tonight. Tomorrow, I should have my trove video up around 3 or 4 Eastern Standard Time. I'm not really sure how late I'm working. And then after that, I'm going to be uploading my video around 7 or 8 o'clock Eastern Standard Time um, for the video out with me and my officers. It's definitely going to be lit. You guys got to stay in tune for tomorrow's video. It's going to be pretty interesting. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, hit the like button down below. Subscribe to the channel if you want to see more content like this. And I hope you all have a great day. I'll see you in the next video. And stay frosty, everybody.